and I'll feel you. I've just lost some space off my roof. You can see the tree behind me and the bushes. They're getting hammered now with wind. Um, okay, so behind me up on my roof line, maybe you can see it. Uh, I've lost some slates and a, and a ridge tile and the rest were rattling around. I thought I was going to lose a whole heap of them, but uh, not so bad so far. Um, I don't know, easily fixed, not too, not too expensive. But um, I, want, I don't know if you can hear me. I want, Jesus Christ. I wanted to do some lifestyle burner videos today. Uh, I was going to make a power unit, but I can't do it because I have no power. Electricity has gone to, uh, I don't know, at least 150,000 people here in this country. Uh, down my part of the country anyway, here in Ireland. Okay, so that's it. I'm sure you can see the bushes moving in the background. So maybe some of you have seen the little stove I made the other day. Um, I left the flue in it. It obviously blew out of it. Let's have a look in the shed now. Okay, so the shed's rattling around a fair bit. Well, the whole thing is vibrating. So anyway, look. This is a real yellow burner. You can, I don't know if you can hear me, my shed is rattling to bits. Riello burner, I'm modifying. Okay, I pulled the jet, the nozzles, all that stuff. Um, I've taken the pump out of it. Uh, I've taken... This is the control box off, and I've taken that off. That's going back on. Okay, just a quick update. This is a siphon nozzle, okay? Um, gets the airline in through the back, and it gets the oil feed in through the, you know, the bottom of it. And what I'm going to do... Because I'm going to convert this uh, Riello burner. Uh, but I can't do it today because I can't actually get the bits. So essentially what happens is that goes in here. You can see that. That goes in here. It's going to get its oil line kind of on a 90 degree bend if you can hear me. Uh, like we're, we're talking serious winds here. I put a weather station up on Mount Lancer. Um, well, when did I do that? I put a weather station up on Mount Lancer about two, three months ago, and uh, I just checked it out, and it's getting, you know, wind in the order, gusting in the order of 99, 100 miles an hour. It's really bad here now at the minute. I'm on top of a hill, which doesn't help. Okay, so here's the electrodes. They're going to go into this now as well. Okay, and they're going to sit on top of, of this. Then what happens is, this guy, this is a shroud, or blast tube. It's going to go over that again. Now, I might have to extend that out, you know, and make a piece of pipe to go between the two of them. So I don't know, and I was planning on doing that today. Um, chances are it can't be heard in the shed, so this one may not make it. And uh, on top of that then, I can't get parts. We've no power in the house, so I can't do any welding. Blah, 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 on and on it goes. So okay, look, that's a quick update. <laughs> Whoa, I don't know if you can see that. No, I don't think you can see that. Let's try this. So that's it. If you liked the video, please thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now. Good luck.